I grew up in a world where the truth was praised and the lie was scolded, deep divers. Now the lie is praised and the truth is scolded, deep divers. Like, it suddenly dawned on me, deep divers, like we are the last ones left. We're the last ones left. Like, there aren't many other people putting the truth out there. There aren't many other people who are helping other people wake up. There aren't many other people who are keeping it real. Let's face it, deep divers. Like, I started YouTube when it was so free. You could literally say whatever you want. And I can still say whatever I want. It's just that now they're censoring the entire internet. They're suppressing the truth. They're taking away your freedom of speech. You can't speak how you really feel about something without them saying, hey, that's not politically correct. Like when I first started Deep Divers, you had documentaries like Zeitgeist, Thrive, all of these documentaries. And like now, what is there? Like everyone is so scared to like speak the truth. This is the end, Deep Divers. It's the end. It's the end, Deep Divers. For the Matrix, not for me or the cat down the road, because every single day I'm... <laughs> Woo! Breathing in that good-ass prana, baby. <laughs> Peace, infinite waters, diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in nature, baby. Shout out to you. Shout out to all the chosen ones. Shout out to all the deep divers who are just woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. This is the end. The title is self-explanatory. This is the end, deep divers. I was recently just going on YouTube and I'm like, oh my gosh, like all my favorite YouTubers who I used to watch, they're no longer making videos. I'm like, this is the end. Like you had so many channels back in the day. Like I would learn from, I would go on their channel and say, okay, let me see this new video about <laughs> what's really going on on the planet. And a lot of these channels are no longer around. And what's happened is that there has been a major purge of the truth. And I realize this is the end. Like, right now, a lot of the youth are so misguided. They're being fed lies by the media. And the media <laughs> emanates from the Greek goddess Medea, the goddess of illusion. A lot of people are living in an illusion. They're under a deep sleep a deep spell. And this always reminds me that this is the end. When I see how easy it was to trick billions of people to be afraid of everyone else, I say, okay, this is the end. But you always know, deep divers, every ending is nothing more than a new beginning in disguise. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? Take that, take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy I'm sending you. Deep divers with the last ones left. I want to start by saying I appreciate each and every one of you deep divers because I can really say whatever I want. I can really express myself however I want. But what makes me feel sad sometimes is to realize that the... The new generation, like the babies, 16, 17 years old, okay, even 14, because I started young deep divers. I was awakening at a young age, 13 I was awakening. A lot of them are being shown imagery which is not based on truth. 
And that's why this is the end of this matrix. George Orwell said, George Orwell said, the only way to control a population is to take away the information from them or give them so much information they are completely overwhelmed. And that's why I don't judge people right now, because on the planet there is so much information everywhere, left, right, center, so many distractions, TikTok, the gram, YouTube, Facebook. Everything can be a distraction. It's all about how you use it to get what you need to go to the next level. But there are a lot of distractions. And I'm here to remind you, this is the end. A lot of people don't want to see that. A lot of people don't want to admit that. But the world has ended in 2020. This is the end. That's why a lot of people have left Earth. <laughs> a lot of people have left the matrix. A lot of people are no longer going back to the system because this is the end. It's all coming out. I want to remind you, deep divers, what the caterpillar calls the end, the rest of the world call a butterfly. Like anytime I'm in nature, I just see a butterfly. And to reach that state, that the butterfly reached, it had to let go. It had to let go of that state as a caterpillar, which was just moving along in a very sluggish way, consuming leaves. It had to let go of all of that. And it had to transcend the lower nature to reach the higher nature. I had to say, deep divers, this is the end many years ago because I was on a road to disaster. The lifestyle I was living was not serving me. I said, this is the end. Then I went through the metamorphosis from a caterpillar to a butterfly. This is the end. I wrote down a whole list, right? <laughs> this is the end of fake personas. You see, the only way this matrix has been going for so long is because of fake personas, fake personas, fake masks. Why am I still here doing a little samba, baby? Because I'm my authentic self every single day. That's why I attract, that's why I attract so many amazing souls to me every single day. I attract my reflections. A lot of people who wore a mask when I first started making videos, their mask started to slip off. And that's what's happening right now in the global world. The mask is starting to slip off. And now people are being faced with a reality that was always here. It was just hidden. This is the end. Lockdown, COVID-19, face masks, protesting, Black Lives Matter. All of these are signs that this is the end. You see, when a fire has consumed everything, the only thing left for the fire to consume is itself. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. I told you, all lives matter. Not just black lives, not just white lives. Color is how they separate you. Race is an illusion. So this is the end of race. And that's how you transcend to become a butterfly. This is the end of man-made organized religions. Religion is for people who are afraid to go to hell. Spirituality is for people who've already been there, who've already been there. <laughs> I met the devil sitting on a bench, deep divers. It was crying. I said, devil, why are you crying? 
He said, because everybody keeps blaming me for their problems. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. <laughs> this is the end, Deep Divers, of supporting a system which only has an agenda of lying to you. Of supporting a system which only has an agenda of hiding the truth from you in the mainstream media. Anything that comes out of their mouth is a complete lie. Why? Because they are bought, they are paid for by the inorganic ones. You can't say what you want to say on CNN, on BBC. You get told what to say. So that's not real journalism, right? I can say whatever I want to say. I'm a free agent. So I want to remind you, deep divers, we take back our power when we, when we realize we can no longer externalize our power. The power was with you all along. It's just that you gave it away because you didn't know it's worth. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. The people who do the most in this matrix get praised the least. The people who do the least get praised the most. This is the end for that. It's ending. People are starting to wake up and they're starting to see the illusion for what it is. I told you, everything in this matrix is rigged. Everything in this matrix is a setup and it's over. It's crumbling. It's coming crashing down. Why? Because it's not built on the truth. Three things you can't hide for too long. The sun, the cat down the road, and the truth. <laughs> okay, there it is. Deep divers. <laughs> numbers. The numbers don't lie. What do they mean by that? This is an ancient saying, the numbers don't lie, meaning that the time you were born, when you were born, I was born on March 3rd at 3.03, I'm 33, that's Christ consciousness, the universe works in my favor. I told you, i got many forces working in my favor. But in this matrix, because everything is reversed, the numbers do lie. Let me give you an example. I can make you a star in this matrix. All I've got to do is change the numbers. I can buy views. I can give you 200 million views on a video. Okay, a million likes. So now I create the perception that, hey, you're the hottest thing on the block. So people say, okay, that's the right thing to do. And that's how they reversed everything in the matrix. You see, people, they were giving you the truth. Bob Marley. But they started to realize the power of music, what it was doing to the youth. It was waking them up. And that's why you had the hippie revolution. People were like, I just want to be free. Then they said, okay, we got to change this. What I'm going to do is give an ignorant individual millions of dollars to dumb down the youth. They only want to target the younger generation. And if you want to know where this planet is heading with COVID-19, with a lockdown, with them taking away your freedom of speech, always look at the youth. You see, the revolution, the rebellion, the revolution and the rebellion always has to take place with the youth. But a lot of the youth are distracted right now. TikTok, Instagram, too busy taking selfies. And that's why they have got the youth drinking Kool-Aid. But I told you, in the prediction video, a lot of the youth are beginning to wake up. You see, it's a blessing in disguise that schools were shut. I repeat, 
it's a blessing in disguise that schools were shut because now the children can get some real education. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. By going on the journey within. Everything out there was designed to enslave you. The only way you can free yourself is going within, within yourself. I want to remind you, deep divers, this is the end. Carry that affirmation anywhere you go for fake ass relationships. What is society? It's nothing more than a relationship between you and I. Many of the relationships in this matrix is based off ego. What can I get instead of what can I give? It's based on lust. And that's why you are seeing the rise of narcissism, okay? A lot of narcissistic personalities because <laughs> the architects of this matrix, they want to turn people into narcissists. They got you so self-absorbed that you forget they're slowly creating a prison for you to live in for the rest of your life. This is the end of that. A lot of people are starting to realize these apps were designed to take away your time. Many of these apps were designed to take away your confidence. You got a lot of young girls, young boys comparing themselves to other people. Even grown folks. Oh, I don't look good enough. They look perfect. Obviously, because they Photoshop their entire face. Never mind. This is the end of the fake. And this is the beginning of the real. You see, we don't really know what it, what it feels like to be liberated from lies, from the lies of the matrix. Because from the moment you were born, you were lied to. When someone gave you a name, you're like, hey, I didn't choose that. Right? That's why in ancient times with the rites of passage, when you came to a certain age, you gave yourself your own name, i.e. infinite waters. Can I get a hello there? Ralph Smart is my matrix name. Infinite waters is my true name. And can you see it's linked to an element? Can you see it's linked to the greatest force on the planet? This is the end, deep divers, of surface relationships. Now with me, everything has got to be deep. It's got to be meaningful. It's got to be intimate. An emoji won't do. you got to meet me in person if you want to talk to me. What? <laughs> This is the end, deep divers, of having a limiting mind. A lot of people say, Ralph, I can't do what you're doing. I say, why not? Your only limitation is your belief system. That's why it's all BS, belief systems. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. I woke up one day and said, I'm going to live like the wealthiest man on the planet. And that's what I'm doing every single day. I'm the wealthiest man in the planet because I have a belief I can manifest anything and I have a knowing I can, I, can, I can manifest anything and what am I doing? I'm manifesting anything because I have no limitation in my mind. This is the end, seven day vegan challenge of them telling you you need prescription drugs, man-made drugs to heal yourself. Do you know, deep divers, I healed myself just by a spirulina smoothie every single day, complete source of protein, just from an E3 Live smoothie, the most nutrient-dense food on the planet, iron, zinc, copper. I healed myself with natural plant-based foods. <laughs> this is the end 
of them telling you, if you want to heal yourself, you need to take these pills. You see, I told you a long time ago, deep divers, nature is so smart, it put the medicine inside of the foods. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. This is the end, deep divers, of being stuck in traffic and not going anywhere. Yeah, they're wasting your life. And now you're wasting your life. You've got to take responsibility. I want to tell you this, deep divers. I bought a new car in 2018. Then I realized I couldn't park anywhere. Oh, no. <laughs> now I just cycle and skate everywhere. And it's a lot healthier for the environment. It's heating up everywhere, deep divers on the planet. I told you, it's 100 degrees right now. And it's been 100 degrees for the last few weeks. Woo! It's hot out here. Not just here, but all over the planet. It's heating up. Global warming. <laughs> right? Because there are too many cars polluting the planet. Because there are too many mines as well polluting the planet. <laughs> so every single day I'm realizing why am I going to spend my entire life in a traffic jam? Why am I going to spend an hour of my time trying to look for a parking space when I can just do a little samba, little two-step to wherever I need to go? When I can just cycle and get fit at the same time to go to wherever I need to go? And also, woo! Breathe in that good ass prana, baby, along the way. This is the end <laughs> of denying the truth. A lot of people say, Ralph, everything is perfect. I say, yes, it can be. But not only do we create our reality, not only do we create our reality, we collectively create a reality because nobody is an island. We are all connected. So there's something called bypassing, spiritual bypassing. When people say everything is perfect in the world, the lockdown, the face mask, it's, it's all perfect. Just, just be quiet. But it's not though. A lot of people are being starved of oxygen. A lot of children, this is all they know. Wearing a face mask every single day. What kind of a life is that? Right? So we, we all got to get real and say this is the end of turning a blind eye about what's happening. Because if you don't do something about what's happening, you can't complain about it. If you don't fight for what you want, you will have to cry for what you lost. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. <laughs> this is the end, deep divers, of buying stuff you don't need with money you don't have to impress people you don't like. <laughs> of flexing. I could buy a Rolls Royce right now, deep divers, if I want, in cash. But I don't have to do that because I don't find my, my worth in material possessions. I find my worth going in here. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. So I said a long time ago, this is the end of me worshipping material possessions. You see, deep divers... Once upon a time, ever read those stories? Once upon a time, <laughs> people were actually loved. I know it's hard to believe right now. People were loved and things were used. But right now, things are being loved and people are being used. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. A lot of people value their iPhone over an actual human being. <laughs> and that's why this is the end. Many people are becoming cyborgs, Neuralink, chips inside of their brain to control how they think, their mood, their temperament. Many people are bots. They've lost any emotion. They've become desensitized. That's why this is the end of the world as you know it in the matrix. The matrix has ended. And another matrix is being installed right now. And that matrix is the artificial intelligence turn human beings into robots matrix. So you got a choice to say, am I going to live here? Or am I going to get off the grid, build an earth home, 
or am I going to leave Earth in a spaceship with a cat down the road? <laughs> I left this system a long time ago, deep divers. I'm just looking from the outside in. I told you I'm a guide. I'm in the world, but not off the world. <laughs> this is the end, deep divers of fear. Worry, doubt, being scared all the time. And this is the start of realizing we all have to let love guide us, not fear. I'm not scared of anything in this matrix, deep divers, because I told you I'm the chosen one. I'm not scared about anything that's happening out there because I don't live in fear. The time you have on this planet is too short to spend a long time being afraid of everything around you. Fear is the greatest energy vampire. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. People often ask me, Ralph, how did you become so confident? The word confident emanates from the Latin confidere, which means to trust. I trust myself first and foremost. Then I trust life. Then I trust the universe. I see the goodness in people, not their worst attributes. I realize that fear is a drug that you don't want to get addicted to. And love is a drug that you, <laughs> you want to get addicted to. It's a self-healing drug. It opens up new doors and avenues. It connects you with people all around the world. It frees your heart from bondage and it moves you. It moves you to places which are good for your soul. Fear will always keep you trapped in the prison. So as they're locking down the planet, and I told you, this is what they want for you and your children and your grandchildren. A fascist state to take away your freedom of speech, to get you vaccinated, to, wear, to have you wearing a mask your entire life. And if you want to talk about it, you can't because your mouth is shut. So this is the end, deep divers. Make sure you sign those divorce papers with this matrix so you can now enter the real world i'm in the real world deep divers just saying feel so good to be alive baby can i get a hello <laughs> beautiful deep divers i'm just woo, breathing in that good ass prana baby they don't make them like this anymore they don't make them like this anymore, deep divers. Shout out to everybody who's been getting the wonderful good ass prana shirts at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com. And if you're a sexy ass model, woo, with a whole lot of heart who wants to model the clothing, let me know. Got a question for me, deep divers? Add me on the Instagram at official Ralph Smart and Facebook at Ralph Smart check out the new book deep divers for more empowering information like this feel alive by ralph smart on amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book deep divers what the caterpillar calls the end the rest of the world calls the butterfly embrace the metamorphosis embrace the ending of the world because it is only a new beginning in disguise have a beautiful day deep divers peace infinite waters diving deep once again stay well stay healthy peace you i'm just woo, breathing in that good ass prana baby so free no ending here, just a new beginning here, doing a little samba baby here, with a cat down the road here, just counting my many blessings here, and it feels so good to be alive here. <laughs> Have a beautiful day, beautiful day, deep divers.
Peace. <laughs>